This video was created by Vinylic Puma of Vinylic Puma Gaming. What's going on everybody? This is Vinylic Puma and today I'm back with another Borderlands video for you guys. So I wanted to do something a little bit different and I wanted to showcase my new weapons pack. Uh, now basically these are guns that are not official although it would be cool if we got some new official weapons uh, for Borderlands the pre-sequel. Hint hint nudge nudge that would be awesome gearbox anyway but as you can see here uh these are guns that don't exist in the game uh this is just modded weapons so i wanted to go ahead and showcase them for you guys and that's mainly because you all liked the firehawk is back video last week now the first one here is called the stinger and uh, this is one that i made a while back it's basically a cyber eagle with like burst fire uh, and as you can see here, it's got like a triple burst fire, uh, and it's pretty cool. I mean, you can uh, you can get some decent crit damage out of it, uh, and it looks pretty interesting. It looks like a really futuristic Jacob's laser pistol. This other one is called the Jericho. It's a cross between the Bullpup and the Torgmata uh, shotguns, and basically it's got the fire rate of the Bullpup, but it has the uh, projectile uh, similarity to the Torgmata. And basically I called it the Jericho because it reminds me of the Jericho missiles from the first Iron Man movie. Uh, now this next one is called the Ant Killer. Uh, this is a cross between, uh, I believe it's like a Lady Fist, Fatal SMG, and the All Painful Assault Rifle. And basically I just came up with the idea for this. Uh, because it is, I, I don't know, I kind of think of like magnifying glasses, and I kind of always felt like since the Mac accuracy, accuracy has to be achieved, um, you get like a, essentially what's kind of like a magnifying glass on people's crit spots. Now this next one is the Moxie's Double D. Uh, basically, this is a uh, hail combined a hail assault rifle combined with a pepper box pistol uh, which and it's the pepper box pistol that can't normally appear in Borderlands 2 or the pre-sequel uh, not the glitch version that can be seen in the pre-sequel uh, and it's got really high critical hit damage uh, you'll see that like the aiming reticle is kind of weird because again uh, that's what the aiming reticle looks like uh, for the hail assault rifle and it's kind of taken on that characteristic so that is pretty cool and finally we have the tri-beam laser rifle uh, basically this also does another exploit uh, where it basically allows you to fire fully automatic uh, while aiming down sights and you'll see here uh, when I go ahead and reload it fires normally but when I aim down sights uh, it just melts everything and of course this one was based on uh, kind of loosely based on like the tri-beam laser rifle uh, from both Fallout 3 and Fallout New Vegas uh, I almost said Fallout 4 there but the tri-beam laser rifle is not in Fallout 4 uh, but anyway guys I think that's gonna pretty much wrap up this particular video uh, let me know what you thought about this I'm gonna leave uh, the gibbed save editor codes for these in the description uh, keep in mind they will only work on PC uh, now to get like it to, to display the text that I've got here uh, you're going to need to edit some localization files uh, I am still working on a tutorial for that so don't worry, that'll be coming at some point. Uh, but anyway, guys, I think that's going to pretty much wrap up this video. Like this video, please be sure to leave a like. As always, take care and I'll see you all next time.